And today I'll be talking about the new Therion cards coming out in Power of the Elements. Well, I actually got the set's name right. Anyways, let's get started. First off, we have Therion's Empress, Arasia. And it's a reptile effect monster, reptile effect earth monster that's level 8, it has 2100 attack and 2500 defense. And in effect reads, you can target one Therion's or Reptile Monster in your graveyard, special summon this card from your hand. And if you do, equip it with that target. So basically the typical Therion's effect. That all of them, except for this card, has. Second effect, you can discard one card, then target one Therion's Monster card in your Spell and Trap Zone, special summon it. Also, fun fact, I did not know this, but... You can use their effects while they're equipped to other monsters. I had no idea that's how that worked, meaning that you could just get, basically get a search as long as you have the searcher on the field, whether it be in the monster zone or in the spell and trap zone. And also you could get the neg Regulus negate even without having Regulus in the monster zone. I don't know, I, I just didn't know that. Until like one Therion's player basically just educated me on that. But anyways, so basically this card can essentially special summon itself if it's in the spell and trap zone. But I can't really imagine why you'd want to do that. Unless you're going for an extra deck play. And for the third effect, it reads, Ethereon's monster equipped to this card gains 700 attack. Basically the effect that all of the Therions kind of have. Except for, again, the new Regulus. Next, we have Therion's Irregular, and it's a machine effect dark monster that's level 10 and has 1600 attack and 2800 defense. And, it's a and its first effect reads, you can target up to three Therion monsters in your graveyard, special summon this card from your hand, and if you do equip it with those targets. So basically this card just gets 2100 attack right off the bat. But that isn't all that impressive since, you know, he has 1600 attack and if you equip two, you'd basically have 14, I guess it would be 3000 base attack, not 3000, basically it would just become 30, yeah, 37. So it's not all that impressive, especially since you can kind of get like you can get close to those big numbers with um, Regulus. I mean, that's neither here or there. It basically just allows you to use a bunch of Therion effects. Since, like I mentioned, you can use their effects even while they're in this spell and trap zone. And the third effect reads... Whoops, whoops. I skipped the second effect. The second effect reads, you can discard one perpetual engine Argo system, destroy all cards your opponent controls. That seems ridiculously powerful. Especially if you have this card in your spell and trap zone, it's just a one-sided Dark Rose. I'm not sure how to feel about that. And for its third effect, I mean, you, you could argue you have to discard this card, but you could easily get this card into your hand. Like, really easily. And the third effect reads, while this card is equipped to a monster, you can special summon it, then equip this card to the monster it was equipped to. I know, that, that effect seems very odd. I'm not sure if this is a typo or an error of some kind, because it... Yeah, it just seems like you just special summon this card from the spell and trap zone, and then just equip it back to the monster it was previously equipped to. I don't see how that... I don't see what purpose that serves, but... It's just there, I guess. Anyways, if, uh, if there's ever a correction, I hope you guys actually let me know, and it's been me, your boy Blagets, again. Tell me what you guys think about these Therion cards, and I'm Yeah, out. it turns out, um... You special summon this card from the equipped from the monster it was equipped to, and then you equip the monster it was equipped to, to that, to Irregular. 
So I'm not sure if there was an error or that I'm just really bad at reading. Then again, I am a Yu-Gi-Oh player after all, so the possibility of being being really terrible when it comes to reading is very possible. Anyways, yeah, I'm out for real this time.